Yeah, welcome back to the den. It's time for Lisbeth to go deep cover. Yeah, and you don't stop. Back in our uh, dog town hideout. Uh, it's time to go play dress up. What the fucking got away? Yeah, and you don't stop. Alright, let's go. Uh, where is the bathroom? It's our bathroom. Not the most glamorous. Uh, where's the bathroom? <laughs> I think it's over here. No, that's the front door. bathroom at. There it is. Alright. Alright. <clears throat> uh oh. Bad what time, Johnny. Fuck? Come on, Johnny, bro. Chill out, homie. Try to do this as so it's like a real chic kind of. Yeah, I can see that or not. Probably not. So it's very long blonde hair with a bowl bangs. So let's see here. First of all, let's get the hair color right. Uh, hmm, okay. Oh, that's probably this one. That's my first guess. That's two gold. Probably that one right there. Yeah, definitely that one. This one's a little too dark. And that one's too white, so. Pretty sure that's the color. Okay, then. Let's see what options we got here. It might not be like it exactly right, but we'll try. Hmm. <laughs> Got to hit that. <clears throat> if you didn't know, Elizabeth is an albino in the book. So her hair's actually dyed black. So in reality, she would have, you know, kind of pale hair. So. Don't quote me on that, though. That, that might be the closest one. I don't know if, it, I don't know if there's a long hair version of that. There might be. Maybe not. 
that? Yeah, it's pretty close. So 17 or 6 so far. Or that one. That one's pretty close. It's just a little too short. So there's a couple options we got. Or that one. We've got a couple options here. Let's try six again. Okay. We do have to take the piercings off. Piercing number three, so I don't forget. Okay. She doesn't do too much to her eyebrows. I can't quite recall if she does anything to them. But for all purposes, we'll, we'll go with that and pretend she put some kind of, you know, something on them to make them pop a little more. She's wearing the smoky shade, so it's not like... So you got like a smoky kind of eyeliner. Uh, where's that gonna be? Makeup. Sorry, Twitch. We could probably go with leaving it and just do like a. Oh, that's too much.
That's better. Okay, so let's get the hair. So which one are we gonna go? We had six, we had I forgot their numbers. That one's really close. Sixteen. And then the one that's almost right was too short. Twenty-four. That's, that probably is the closest one. I don't want the longer one. I think that's just, that's the closer one. Even though the bangs aren't quite right. That's probably the closest one though. Stick, drift, stick, stick, drift on this one. Uh, Twenty-four. Oh, 
Why did it lay like that? It lays all fucking weird. That's so weird why it bunches out like that. Is it the is it the glasses? No. Hmm. Okay, so twenty four is out. So Go with that one, even though I like that one's a little cooler. Okay. This drift. That's not good. When did my controller get? What, what did I just do? Oh shit! What does that button do? What am I doing? What? What? What did I just do? I think I just got rid of them. Or I dropped them. So I dropped. Oh. Yeah. I don't want to do that. Jesus. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, uh, so let's try to get a. Maybe. Where are the dresses at? Like Nina from Tekken now. <laughs> I don't really have a lot of dresses. Hmm. How shiny that shit is. or nothing. Okay, let's see here.
Where's the silver one? Nope. Where is the silver one? The really gaudy one. I think I like that one the most because the tattoo can't show because Or that one Oh yeah, that one looks coolest
That's too unfortunate, you can't fuss around with them. That was nice too, though. Think about the back. I think that's the best one. Is that the bra doing that? No. I don't know, I thought the pink blazer is kind of nice though. <laughs> you can hear the high heels. That's funny. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not happy about the st stick drift. Oh, it's 
Not good. When did that start? That is scary. <sighs> Come on, Sony. $70, you gotta make a better controller, bro. It's only in that menu, too, because it's not happening now. Oh, there, there, there it is. That's frustrating. I love the high heels. You there. This is a nice place. So play nice, hear me? Got our eyes everywhere.
Lot of hustle around. Got big guests in from the city? Mm-hmm. Almost every day. We get all kinds of traffic in here from peeps looking to settle their biz in peace and quiet. Not many sides us can offer that. What you looking at, huh? He use a drink. Thanks. Father must get back to work now. Okay? Okay. Ah, it isn't V. V, my favorite Merc. Splendid. 
What you completed for me significantly shifted the playing field vis-a-vis -vis Hanson. Excellent work, precisely as requested. Come on, Hans. Flattery, really? Seems a little beneath you. An overused tactic. Agreed. Unnecessary. No, V, this is strictly business. For those who do their work well, praise is a mere restating of the facts. Maybe the one thing I didn't expect, to see the man behind the hollow curtain. The elusive Mr. Hands in the flesh. Not only did you rescue those clowns in blue, you also managed to eliminate Dodger. Calm, collected, and professional. Bravo. You have proven to be a person I can trust. Hence my decision to drop the veil and meet in person. A rare occurrence, I assure you. 
Were I to have more virtuosos like you, I wager I'd have more than Dogtown in my grasp. Dogtown, Pacifica, then I'd line up the rest, snort, and it'd be done. Working with bona fide professionals, positively a treat. Hope all that hard work won't go to waste. Profit for me means profit for you. Nothing simpler. You may not know this, but I hasten to assure you no one has ever regretted doing business with me. I know it may not seem all that clear from where you stand, but the gigs you have completed will allow me to audaciously shift some of the pawns and figures on the chessboard that is Dogtown. Checkmate is but a few moves away. Take it you'd prefer Dogtown with no Hanson at the helm? Hanson wields much power, greedily so. He's also clever. These traits I tolerate, even value, when occurring in isolation. But all at once, no. Especially not in one who grips an entire district in the palm of his hand. It makes business... trying. And arrest you in some tea. It's my own blend. Sure, why not? So, how did this combat zone become Dogtown? Do you know? Let's table politics for now, huh? Go straight to base? Business. Of course. The Black Sapphire. Hanson Stronghold, guarded by elite soldiers. Military quarters are situated on lower levels, while top floors are a decadent haven for the ultra-rich. The building's blueprint was not easily procured, I should say. Hanson guards his hotel secrets as if they were an embarrassing rectal itch. But, given a will, ways are usually found. You help a client of mine, they reciprocate, and I gain latitude. Quid pro quo in full effect. The building plans are yours. I'll even throw in vulnerabilities to watch for, a token of my appreciation. And, though this goes without saying, the data, its source, are completely secure. No one knows you have it. Data leaks, or lack thereof, are the difference between myself and, say, the late Mr. Deshawn. The Shard. Black Sapphire Info and Blueprints. All nooks and crannies. I trust it's all you need to waltz in and perform your planned pirouettes. Yet a word of caution. Even fully prepared, you'll be marching into a pit full of vipers. Watch your step. Thanks, Hans. I only hope this won't mark the end of our collaboration. Truth be told, a few new assignments seem imminent. Let me guess. More local political gaming? Activity is abundant in Dogtown, and behind closed doors, plots and schemes. Should change ever occur, as it inevitably must, someone really ought to pave the way for a smooth transition. Be looking forward to those new gigs, then. You will hear from me soon. This, I guarantee you. And V... Whatever happens at the Black Sapphire, make sure you come back alive. Mm. You're going <laughs> where local and international politics mix. 
Strong currents, both. I'll make sure to plant <laughs> my feet firmly then. Later, hands. That's funny. That's like the last John Carr story. It's not even about John Carr. I think it's about the dude after him. <laughs> Great series books. You should, everybody go read that. John Carr of Mars. Actually, the chessmen were. Eh, no, I don't think so. Did we read. I, Lady Wolf and I read about three or four of them. But, uh, then eventually, it breaks off to not even being about John Carr anymore. It's about the dude after him. music playing. That was weird. the data shard from hands our golden ticket into the black sapphire perfect sent to no worries this connection is secure catch it's on its way and reception complete i'll pass it on to alex and as soon as you're ready join us at the moth i'm not there when you arrive just wait until then a job, V. A journalist, Bree Whitney, has fled into Dogtown. I need you to look after her. She fled? Means I gotta keep her tucked away? No. Bree has a lead. You're to help her complete her investigation. There's a corp on her tail, as she put it. That is all she said. Miss Whitney seems to have some minor trust issues. Right, so, where am I meeting this mystery insistent woman? You'll go to her apartment first, on Skyline West. You're to collect an electronic access card. 
And no, do not say this card once it open. I simply don't know. Contact me once this is sorted. You'll learn more details then. to it. This the relic? Long story, but yeah. It's pulling a hostile takeover of my brain. You experience them often? These attacks? Don't really keep count, but never know if the next one won't be my last. No shit. Death's breathing down my neck. Always. I know what that feels like. Truly. How would you know? I never talked about this, you know. I should be saying they tried to kill me, but sometimes it feels like they actually succeeded. So I'm talking to a ghost? Ambush. Attempt on my life seven years back. Yeah, he said. What exactly happened there, Reed? I landed in the ICU. Why I waited for some Arasaka goon to come finish me off. I was betrayed by our people, the FIA. I say betrayed, but I was sold out. Part of a deal, a peace offering. My head on a silver platter, all for a ceasefire. Peace comes at a price. Someone's always got to pay it. Come on, I want to show you something.
I get it. You feel responsible for her. Your captain, she's crew. No matter what sinking ship she's on, I'll be there to get her off. Even if I have to go down with it. Let's go. Let's ride down. Where are we headed? On a little trip down memory lane. To see some old junk. I still can't believe Alex decided the best place for a bar was right over our old safe house. She's always had a twisted sense of humor. Where's she at? Waiting downstairs? She's finishing up recon in town. We should make ourselves at home until she gets back. Been dark for seven years, this place. Let's brighten things up again. Any war is never pretty. Both sides race to tie up loose ends. A car bomb blew up one of my crew. Another was poisoned. A third got shot in the back of the head while buying a pack of smokes. A couple others just vanished without a trace. Every night we waited for Arasaka agents to come finish us off. I had to make a choice. I chose to dig our heels in. I thought we still had a fighting chance. It was bold. It was stupid. A mix of both. Maybe I just didn't know how to walk away. Let it rest. Or maybe I don't know how to lose. Either way, we managed to save a few more agents. The price for that was yours truly. A tragic story, that. Well, I wrote it myself. You play grown-up games, you face grown-up consequences. Funny. Out of everyone. It was Songbird they asked to pull the trigger. Wait. Yeah. Mm. Pulled the trigger as in literally took out her iron and shot you. Not personally, but she unlocked the door for those who came and did. I was leaving the city, heading home. Songbird was still here. In this very room, in fact. It was guiding me on comms, led me straight into a trap, neutralizing me. The last assignment in Night City. Then she got a ticket home. Reed, what you're doing now is saving her, or is it revenge? I don't have a vengeful bone left in me. I had plenty of time to examine this under a microscope. Under focus, some things sharpen, others blur. But there comes a point when you just cut through the bullshit and see what's in front of you. Soundbird is still my people, and nothing can change that. Fuck, Reed. Now, my is, is a whole nother story. And Songbird, no. I got nothing against her. So why Myers? I miss anything? Some reminiscing. So good. Let's get this show going. I checked up on Slider's contention. Looking how to write, it turns out. I dove into old mission files wherever Somi was involved. They were buried deep. Near impossible to access, even with my clearance. Each and every one. 
the Black Hawk. All authorizations, mission orders, personally signed by one person, Rosalind Myers. Hmm. Wouldn't want to be in her shoes if that shit floats to the top. The NUS is a small country governed by a woman of highly ambitious goals. Sometimes those ambitions went out of reason. But that's not something we need to pour over now. Alex, what do you have for us? Oh, a little of this, a little of that. We'll plan in a sec. Say, V. Like playing fancy dress up? <laughs> I already did that.
All right, I'm back. Of course, he doesn't. Mm, then you'll like what I whipped up. Oh, come on. You gonna steal my thunder? Managed to learn that some pop megastar is gonna grace the party with a show. Guest list? Expect everybody who's anybody. That includes you. Gonna don fancy outfits and rub shoulders with VIPs. Be warned, though. Fancy doesn't mean easy. Ready for the deets, V? Let me hear them. I'm, I'm so dripped out. Come on. You get it? Black Sapphire, the most heavily guarded place in Dogtown. Doesn't mean security's airtight, though. V, you're gonna enter through a flooded tunnel system. Got a top of the line diving suit, ought to fit you snug as a glove. Water's maybe a little super toxic. So, yeah, be careful. Toxic how, exactly? From suspect waste. And sewage leak too. Don't worry, suits piss and shit proof. Already know what the hotel looks like. Really, really hard to miss. Flooded tunnels here. That's your way inside. Now focus. You'll reach terminal at the end. Jack in and reach the cams, giving Reed his window to slip into the building. You'll take different elevators up here. Solid open a passage to his side. Before you ask, yeah, it's the only way. Area could be heavily guarded, so you'll have to be on your tippy toes. Couldn't get clean intel, so you'll just have to be creative. Improvise. You're gonna meet here. Soon as you meet up, you'll doll up like it's prom night and go to the ball. That's where you'll rendezvous with Songbird. All clear? Yup. Prime. Okay. Let's talk gear. Take your time. Grab anything you think might be useful. A surprise awaits you in the box. Is this your iron? Unity. Sure is. Her Majesty has been itching to return to active duty. I'd be honored. What did he want in return for the favor he did us? Dogtown's locked in a never-ending power struggle. A lot of biz to go around, but only Hansen reaps the rewards. Hans is gunning to diversify who controls what, when, and where. 
My skills and know-how are to facilitate that. Politics. It's the same shit wherever you go. You know, if not for you, we'd have no way of getting into the Black Sapphire reaching Sombird. It's good to have you on our side. I mean that, V. That it? We set? I believe we are. I'll hang back a while and then meet you there. Place stinks of memories, huh? A little dusty, but well preserved. What are we gonna do with it once I'm on the Riviera? Gonna lock yourself in here, fondle all this old dead tech till your balls shrivel up? Burn it to the grounds, my little bit. And never come back. Now that I like.
resources. She served for 26 years and supported the establishment of nursery schools, raised the drinking age from 14 to 18, and was a famous rival of mine, Mr. Winston Churchill. During the World War II, she took an unpopular stand of the They went to the city to pick up the merch. Never came back. Relax. Probably just holding them at the border. This is all on the side. What a fucking shit style. Reed, you copy? Made it to the hallway. Copy you loud and clear. I'm in position two. Got him down. 
Set myself a safe path to a past. So look, uh, lower that platform. Thank <laughs> you. 
to the outpost. Approaching warehouse gate now. If it is, then either it's been stolen or I'm just fucking black. <sighs> Sure am. At the warehouse gate, you'll need to secure the area, crack it open from the other side. Bullshit. Okay, fine. I'll take another look. Back this bitch up! This fire rate on that thing is terrible. Gosh. Oh, 
in the perimeter. Before dawn. Already told you. Boss found it in my locker. John. One o'clock. What? It's Percy Jackson time. Okay, fam. Oh. Would you just listen to me for a second? But these need deliverance, Shun. Not through here, they don't. VIPs only. So where am I supposed to... Do I look like the fucking hotel receptionist to you? Other entrance. Delivery. Did you spot anything interesting? Liquor boxes and such. Of course. Ah, oh, there you are. What's the sitch? See a gate. Two guards. Don't worry about them. Jimmy, open that gate. Roger that. Gotta be checked out. Gotta be here somewhere. Wow, those gunks. See this? Someone was fucking around here. Think we got visitors. God damn it. to Papa. Uh, 
Take positions, people! Sure. We're in the wolf's den now. You scared of him? Hanson. The man's repeatedly told both the NUSA and NICE to go fuck themselves. He should have been put down long ago. Instead, he rules this entire district. Well, so you are scared. This is Hanson's surf. He has the upper hand. It's just a fact that needs accepting. Does it mean I'm shaking at the knees? Hell no. Find a vantage point to have eyes on me. Neutralize any and all. Drop the sniper. Nestin in his perch now. At the perfect vantage point, saw everything. Cover me. You're in prime duck hunting position. New user detected. Calibration in progress. Firing mode inactive. I'm in position. Do you have a visual on me? I got you. What now? We do this nice and quiet if we can. Got it? Spot any guards in my way, give me a heads up. Don't worry, boss. Rifle sports a silencer if it comes to that. Better look around. Got a mine just past the corner. Well spotted. I could have missed it. Healthy smattering of guards along their path. Copy that. We'll take them out one by one. Best if they never knew we were here. Cams galore here. Should have access once the sniper's nest completes calibration. Good. They could prove useful. I've got eyes on a sniper. Further down. He's not a threat yet. We'll deal with him later. Spray paint again last night. See a bunch of containers. Could use them to get to your side. Yeah, see him too. Let me build that bridge. There's a service elevator nearby. We'll take that up. Gotta get there first, though. Cover me. Calibration complete. Firing mode active. Don't forget, hallway's mine. Besides that, the coast is clear. Understood. Moving out.
hard work. I can't see around the corner. Clear? Am I okay to move on? Control incoming. Copy that. Moving towards cover. Well, I guess it's time for a little walk around the block. Sensor disabled. Good work. Proceeding forward. Surveillance system link established. I need an assist. You take the guard on the left. The one behind the wall is mine.
drone's headed your way. Take them out before they reach you. that up like a bunch of rookies. But there's no going back. Elevator, follow me. Heavy. Fucking finally. You're looking a little pale. Yeah, well, you didn't almost drown today. Are you sure you're okay? I'm fine. You scanning me? Your cortisol level spiked up. A little deja vu is all. Different elevator, different hotel. The sitch didn't turn out great. What makes you say that? It's my job to notice things like this. Wasn't born yesterday, you know? Seen my fair share of shit, too. I know. But right now, we're crashing the party of a bad boy dictator. While aiming to walk out with his prized possession. Dress up time. Throw on your new threads and plaster on your best fake smile. A party awaits. We're all set.
Gotta hand it to Hanson, V. Party's hopping. Has a sense of grandeur. Didn't have shit like this in mind. Now hop on over there and help me out. Managed to forget what real champagne tastes. Say again? Maintenance area? Where exactly? Wounded or do we have bodies? Fuck. Yes, sir, I will. Uh, affirmative. Four and seven will ship post immediately. I'll be at the bar if you need me. Welcome. Would you care for a beverage? V, this guy looks exactly like your Ronin. Unfucking canny. Sure that ain't Takamura? Okay, just one more. Drinks up. Yes. You look exactly like my friend Goro Takamura. Did he also just get out of rehab? Lost his employer recently. They were close. He's adjusting to his new life. Not easy for a guy like him. Had him not to lose hope. If one is industrious, there is no shortage of work in Night City. Maybe your friend would like to try his hand at show business. I could use a double for rainy days. <laughs> Might actually take you up on that. I'll let him know. Watch out. I will hold you to your word. Thanks a lot. about who has the right credentials. You just have to speak Hansen's language. You think Hansen will agree to revitalize 10% of the zone because of a few trumped-up military slogans? That's not what I mean. He needs to be shown his projected profits and losses in plain writing, without any shit. Uh, we need equipment that can withstand and remain reliable in extremely low temperatures. Well, an Argentinian friend. What now? I know as much as you do. All she said was to come here. She'll either find us, or she left us something. And you? What's your play? Think I'm starting to feel the vibe. Just remember what we're here for. To my right, Booth's far back, behind the stairs. The guy in the fatigues. Looks like he came here straight from a firing range. Owner of the Black Sapphire, Mr. D-Town himself, Kurt Hansen, clearly having a great night in the company of the NCPD commissioner. PA broadcast, he fiercely anti-law enforcement. It's an act. Behind closed doors, he's rubbing elbows and patting backs of NCPD's top brass. Avoid him, especially in the confrontation. Besides that, stay visible. Songbird said she'd find us here. Let's give her a chance. I'll grab a drink and look around. Open line on comms. Don't press anyone too hard. We need to keep up appearances. Look like you're having fun.
aim to get fucked up on Hanson's dime than puke all over his carpets? Respect. Thanks. Here you are. Thanks. The table is being prepared. Betting come on, come on. Minutes. One more win. Just one more. This table is full. Please join another. Thank you. The system is foolproof. I saw you, simping for that mangy slut from N54. Honey, I was just being nice. You claim Kurt was pleased, so and I'm I puzzled why he withheld his support. You're if only in your negotiations with the, the bald twerp from the consulate. I think he wished to appeal neutrality. The same as up again? again? We didn't yes, pursue it. We have you bars to have him up here in neutral now. That's the same as the but I'm sure. It's so good you're here. Don't know what I'd do without you, V. Really. Good to finally meet you in the flesh, face to face. The way our last combo ended was troubling. The uh, runner, your friend, who, who helped us reconnect last time, killed him. Fried him, didn't I? Yeah, his death's on you. Sorry to hear it. Not something I intended. Things happen. I ran out of time to explain everything. all I've made so many mistakes it's all right so not your fault the blame's on us all of it on you I is all of them I know what they made you do they pushed and pushed and I, I wasn't there to stop it listen guys we do not have the time for this now. Right. Main thing is to get you out of here. That's not happening. It is. We got in, we can get out. Just Not the me. point. I'm dying, Saul. Like V. Hansen has the cure we need. Ooh. We run now, we both die. Relic's killing V. Blackwall's my poison. I can't bow out now. Oh, Sharon and Boat to Oblivion with me. Could have said something. Had no time. Still don't. But hear me out. I need help. Your help. Hansen pulled some tech out of a bunker under Dogtown. Tech that could cure both V and me. We need to clep it. 
Only way I see of doing that is to stay close. Play the prisoner. So, oh, fuck. We'll wait for an opportunity and pounce. I'll be on the inside. Ask for your help when the time's right. I can flee once I have that tech. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Ah, so me. Care to introduce your friends? It's not often I'm simply not familiar with guests attending my own party. And I never forget a face. Kurt Hansen. Name's V. So me is plus one. Hmm. Plus two, I'd say. In any case, enjoy your evening. Well, I need to grab you, darling. I have a couple NC politicos here who are dying to meet you. And if we're to keep hungry rats from devouring Dogtown... I'm all yours, Kurt. See you soon, V. Established our link the moment I touched you. Interesting. I need a minute to process. And I need a drink. Headed downstairs. I'll explain everything. Just need you to listen. Lied to me, Song. Said you had the cure. No mention of a fuckload of flaming hoops I gotta jump through to get it. It was no trick. Just didn't tell you the whole story. V, I... I can't explain everything now. It's... too much. But I really do need your help. All I want is to get that cure for us. It's what I've been chasing all along. The cure. How do we get it? We need the Neural Matrix. Secret tech that incorporates AIs from beyond the Black Wall. The Matrix is nested in a mainframe Hansen pulled out of the bunker. The mainframe secured. But Hansen lacks the key. That's the problem. Neural Matrix? What is it, exactly? In short, it's storage. A carrier for an AI trapped within certain boundary conditions. When the AI is triggered, it'll execute what's stipulated within those conditions. But I really can't go into detail now. We don't have the time. Got a plan? Spill it. Hansen needs me and a duo of runners who worked on this tech in the past. They actually grabbed access codes they're willing to unload for a price. Classic black market shit. They're bringing access, I'm bringing know-how about how to pull the matrix and data off the mainframe. We're to work side by side, giving us a chance. You clip the access codes, then get the runners out of the way. You'll then impersonate them for a meet with Hansen. Say meet while we'll swipe the matrix out from under his nose. So, runners, we're to impersonate them? How? Personality theft tech. Arm kind of specializes in it. Alex and Reed know it well, they'll explain. Of all people, couldn't have imagined those two would be on our side, helping. Think I got it. Our targets, where are we finding them? They're here, downstairs. Red-headed twins, walled to the teeth with ice. Grocery scans will show you bunk. Cream. Noted. Anything else? Champagne glass over there. Prep some intel for you. Get it to read. You'll need it later. Really need to go now, V. I'm counting on you. Songbird? Great. Okay.
A pleasant evening to you. Seems your special agent. Talk to Songbird via the relic. We can communicate again. Mm. All good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity, and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe at Myers's head. Handsome. Yeah, but not really. Don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Huh. What you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. Too early for conclusions, don't you think? Got no proof she planned this in advance. Could have improvised. Reacted to facts. Come on. You don't actually think she learned about the cure just now? She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to before any of this went down. Traded the president's life for access to the tech. The NUS press sold to a crime lord. Huge. If true. Myers pressured Somi to reach further, breach boundaries. And then Somi snapped. <sighs> Don't know about that. Song recruited me specifically to pull Myers out of that wreck. I seriously doubt she wanted her dead or snatched by Hanson. 
It's never that simple, V. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hansen and you. She has Hansen set. Then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always her strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. Still trust her. Trust she'll keep her word. Promise me the cure, and I fully intend to get it. Only thing that matters, really. I'll be careful. Mind sharp. Eyes and ears attuned. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. So, what are you thinking about all this? I'm not convinced Somi's to blame for everything. In this trade, nothing's ever as it seems. You gotta keep asking questions till you get to the bottom of it. That's experience talking. Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch. And we'll see which direction to take. Just want what Songbird promised me. The cure. That's it. Understood. I'll handle the rest. The fallout. Right. Back to the sitch at hand. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hansen. Prep for it's required. Because we show up as a pair of runners. Need to collect their identities first, whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? So how's one go about it? Clubbing someone's personality? FIA Menanthropic Tech. Alex has access. You should have used it already. You look, sound, and act like the individual whose personality you assume. To do it, what? we need scans of our targets. What? I know, but okay. <laughs> Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Okay. Our target to a brother and sister, red hair twins. I prefer the okay. Near somewhere, schmoozing. Hell. Oh. Okay, we need to pull data. Get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, scan as we talk. Got it. I think. So, time to make our move? Over there. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear. Prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. V, zip and funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach. And we're strangers. Let's get to this. <laughs> oh no, man. Struck gold with roulette, really. Okay. Gambling throws people around. High and low. Brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Greetings, madam. Wanna buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. Red or black only. None of the double street or basket bullshit. Understood? Understood. Alright. I think that's a good spot. Casino Royale actually. Fun? Something's gonna go wrong. That's next time, yeah. Pretty cool, plot's thickening.